Okay, we're going live in, uh, at Elias Pet Store in Los Angeles, 1808 East Florence. So we have the team right here, killing my chickens and my pigeons. Are you guys saving the bands? Are you saving the bands and the birds? So how do you know? We're recording the band number now on this piece of paper. Uh. <laughs> so they're killing all the birds, all the birds are banded. But then they're not recording which birds they killed. So I've been under quarantine for over a year now. And they banded all my birds so I wouldn't have no problem. They could tell which ones were sick or not. Now they're killing all of them without recording the bands. I don't understand these people. Come kill your birds, and I record nothing. I asked for a double test on one of the roosters that were po found positive. I had it close to a year now with Ban, and they were tested at least four or five times. As you see, there's no access right here to the back. There's no way I could get infected. So uh, right now, all the all the things are are uh, uncovered because they're working on it. But I usually cover them with a uh, netting. As you can see, it's dark, and you see the netting on top. There's no access for other birds or pigeons to come by, and. I have one employee, seven days a week cleaning, using a strictly biosecurity uh, protocol. So many times I ask them to give me something in writing, they have never complied with it. It's very hard to get a, something in writing from them. And they're just big bullies. If they're a government agency, I cannot do nothing about it. Now they've tested my birds many times this year, but I've been testing my animals for over 10 years now. Not as often, but like every six months, they tested all my animals. Sure.
Yeah, Lani. All this time waiting for me to retire so I could breed birds, raise pigeons, show pigeons, and now this. I'm very sad. To me, it's not just a business. It's my form of life. Yeah, you're right, Luis. Pinches culeros. Besides ruining my business, they they ruined my life. You know, we're actually total 12 people working here. And I have everything very clean, as clean as possible. Look at my floors, it's clean. Let's get, look at the cages, they're clean. I spent a lot of money building this business. I have signs, Clorox, sanitizers, uh, boots, everything. This is a family business. We're 12 people working in this store. It's including my sisters, my sons. And we've been, for a lot of years, we've been here. 33 years, exactly. So I'm over here in, in Los Angeles, by Florence Avenue and Close to Huntington Park. To me, They're messing with my, the way I make my living and with my whole family. And they're just big bullies trying to ruin us. That's okay. I guess I start all over. Thank you.